Hello, nonfiction and STEM fans. This is Kirsten Larson. I am the author of Woodwire Wings, Emma Lilly, and Todd and Vincent Airplane, here with another nonfiction or STEM book review. Today, I am looking at the absolutely hilarious 13 Ways to Eat a Fly. This is by um, Sue Heavenrich, who I've known in the Kidlet community for a long time, and it's illustrated by David Clark. So this is hilarious. Um, it is a rhyming book. I'm just going to read you the first thread, uh, spread. Excuse me. It says, here it is, so you can see the pictures. Big flies, small flies, fat flies, thinner. Yum, these flies are someone's dinner. So then the book counts down and tells all the different ways that birds and other bugs and even Venus flytraps eat flies. And it's all told in rhyming. And then for um, older readers or um, students who want to learn a little bit more, each and every page includes um, non-rhyming sidebars that give some more information. So I just want to show you one of my uh, favorite couple of spreads. It counts down from 13 to 1, but number 3 is liquefied. That's the Venus flytrap liquefying the fly to eat it. And number 2 is zombified. Um, so this is a, a great read aloud for students, um, a wonderful way to learn about all the animals who are dependent on flies for their food source with lots of hilarious illustrations. Um, and I love this clever back matter, The Non-Human Insectivore's Guide to Fine Dining. Even gives you some nutrition information about flies. Um, this, in my opinion, is a must read. It's fantastic expository fiction, I mean nonfiction, um, told with a humorous rhyming voice. Um, kudos to Sue Heavenrich and David Clark for the perfect 13 ways to eat a fly.